What's up, everybody? We're coming at you live with some of the Us Can 3v3 tournaments. Uh, tonight with us, we have Bama. What's going on, everybody? What's going on, man? 3v3s. All right, guys. So this is kind of uh, it's kind of unique how this works. So in counter battle, uh, random, if they get a Cold War map, we do have to back out and reset. Um, I think they're talking in PM, so I don't know how match chat's going to go. But um, whoever is the, I believe the host team, which I believe is the Ux Can side, uh, they get to pick tier first. So it looks like we're going to start out with tier eight. Now after this, then the other team will get to pick a tier and we'll go back to random map. We're only playing one side of the map. They're not swapping sides. So it'll be a new map every round. Wow. All right. <clears throat> Hopefully, uh, that's all the rules we have to understand. Um, I don't do my homework, man. I'm very lazy. I do not either. So let's see. Let's see. Hello? I was hoping Nick would be in here. Uh, no. I think he was eating while he was yeah. going to watch. Uh, it looks well, like he just, just replied to... back in, uh, yeah. he just replied in. Yeah. He's yeah, not at his works. Xbox. <laughs> All right. I'm out back in the other party. We're about to start once I get them to say they're ready. I'm assuming they're ready. They got three tanks up, so. <clears throat> yeah, I mean, they look ready. Hopefully they'll, uh. <sighs> yeah, hopefully we don't I get don't... poo pooed on. Anyway. Hopefully this Look. is a good show for y'all. Mm. Hopefully. All right. I gotta remember to lock the party so I'm streaming. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. So I think you said uh, he was gonna launch it. Well, uh, hopefully soon. I mean, they got three picked up, so with a little bit of luck. Uh, let's see what I was looking for before he joined. Uh, you can pick any tier between five and ten. No more than one of the same tank, so they can only pick one of each tank. But I was thinking, but no more than two of the same class. Okay, max one auto loader. Looks like everybody is good. No crazy rule breaking tonight. Just waiting on a picked up. So tier eight. Oh, swamp. Tier eight on swamp. Huh. Kind of surprised we're not seeing any Astron Rexes coming out. I don't know. I mean, you don't know what map you're going to get, so I mean, I guess you got to play tanks that you got to trust in. Um, which side do you want to take tonight? I will take the Uxcan side. Alright. Go ahead and grid. that side, we got that Torvogan, a Type 59-2, and a 1.30 PM. Alright, and over on the 1TC side, we have the Roger Dodger Durano, the ISU-152K. So the vision is definitely with uh, the X can side a little bit here. Yeah, yeah. I mean that's uh, five fifty nine. I mean I don't think it's great on vision, but it's gonna be better than those heavies, I would assume, depending on how he has it set up. One thirty should not get spotted very easily. Yeah, that's that's what I was about to say. Is that one thirty's got stupid good camo? We will find out momentarily, though. He's in a good spot with that 130 because he can watch both ridge lines there, I do believe. And they are both spotted. They spotted each other. Oh, there we go. Now, can they ask you get a shot? No, Roger Dodger, staying safe, tucked in. But if this Rhino decides it's going to push out. Now that Torvogan tier 8 uh, heavy tank, I have not much experience with that thing. 
I think I played one game in it. Oh, he does take a shot from Roger Dodger, though. Now, this is with the issue. Might be an issue if Roger Dodger overcommits here. I haven't really played the Roger Dodger. Oh, yeah, and this is oh, where the issue might comes. come in. Oh, he, oh, misses, he misses the shot, the shot. though. Torvagen goes down. All right, this is where they've got to, uh, they've got to capitalize on this. Now, as you should, yes. can he get a shot into the Rhino? He does. Yes, he does. Still not spotted, though. Ooh, TD Ooh. gets a good shot of the 59. Rhino takes a shot, misses his shot. They know where the SU is now. Ooh. Lance down to one shot. Roger Dodger takes a hit from the TD. Yep, yep. He's got to stay safe. Oh, oh TD's on fire. fire. He's going to burn out. All right, top 59 left with 13 shot. HP. Rhino misses the shot again on the T-59. He does get out of there for the four now. Can he get undetected, though? I mean, yeah, he's going to get undetected, but I mean, at this point, you got 13 HP. It's 3v1. Oof. Okay, I shoot. Ooh. Oh, 59 bounces Ooh, a shot. Bounces Gets another shot of the Rhino. But Roger Dodger is coming up very quickly. Yep, he should. Oh, I don't know. Lance might have time to dip down. You have to be careful, though. He uh, doesn't have a lot of HP to spare on a bump. Ooh, is he going to get him here? Roger should have him. There he goes. All right. All right. He takes the first, uh, first round. Right. Oops. <laughs> I hit record instead of go live. <laughs> well, that's okay. Uh, well, we'll be coming live right here on this end screen, guys. Uh, I do have it recorded, so the full video will be up on YouTube. Sorry about that. Bad streamer here. All right, feel free to uh, take uh, take your damage. I'll go down the other. All right. On the Uxcan side, we got the Type 59 coming in with 11.92. Good trash at 1.30 p.m. 10.93. Pounds two and the toboggan, 1.17. Yeah. And uh, over on the 1TC side, uh, Craves in the Roger Dodger with one kill, 18.84. Pin in the ISU, one kill, 17-18, and Dr. Weenus in the Rhino, one kill, 398. You know what? I kind of do like this new, uh, new overlay here. It's not bad. I still it's not as bad as it bit. could be. I mean, yeah, I, I don't know. I like it a little bit better. All right. All right, now... Are they just going to play tier 8s again? Oh, they're swapping sides. Or I guess they're going to play 8s again. Guess so. Now, Ben, I know you, you played your first round, right? I did not. I had a buy round first round. Oh, crap. <laughs> well, when we played ours, we played... Uh, I think they picked the team we played against picked seven then we picked ten then they picked uh nine like i mean we we changed tiers every really every game so There's i'm wondering seven. if that's what they're supposed to 
make a new tier now? Maybe? I don't know. Yeah, I'm a bad thing because I, I don't. I don't do the rule book, right? I, I just play. I just show up and do what the, do what people tell me. Same. Well, I have to tell people what to do, but, you know, I ask Dolphin what the rules are. <laughs> yeah, that's what I did. I was like, okay, Dragon, what are we doing next? <laughs> exactly. Dolphin, what's the rules? <laughs> and you got that, and then, you know, you just got killing, killing everybody. I mean, it worked out pretty well for me just to sit there and, you know, pull a trigger. Alright, I think they just got uh, Only Caves a permission here to see the chat so we should get some match chat here going on in, uh, in just a minute and then we'll get to round two It looks like you're actually supposed to play both sides of the or play the same tier. Huh. Well, maybe we played... Well, I don't know. Um. Team, no? Okay, so example, Team 1 flips the coin, chooses the first round. After the first round is complete, Team 2 chooses their tier and swap sides, and the pattern continues until the team gets three bangs. So you were right. You choose a different they are supposed to time. swap. Well, maybe they just repicked eight. All right, well, over on the 1TC, they're coming back out with that Roger Dodger. They're coming out with the uh, Reaper Scythe, and then the uh, ISU-152K again. All right, on the other hand side, we got the Skoda T-56, the T-32, and a Bone Shaker. I don't know. Let's see what happens here. Now, we are uh, we are on Abbey this time around, so... Pearl River? I mean, Pearl River. Why did... Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I haven't, I've had two hours sleep. Like, I'm not doing good to it's take out. It's forgivable. It's very forgivable. I mean, I already forgot to go live on the stream. Thankfully, I did hit record. So, we do have all the lost footage saved. That will be on YouTube but tonight. About an hour after this, uh, this stream, I will make sure it is up as fast as possible. All right. Roger Dodger all right. already spotted. He did. He did get spotted. They took some shots. Everybody missed. Now, these guys are just kind of the, the ice and the Reaper. They are sitting back, but I don't think any of these guys are going to be spotted in time for them to get any shots off. Now, Cage is going to have to be careful here. I mean, the one thing from playing in this and seeing this match, I mean, if he's alone up there, they've got to take that 3v1 overmatch and knock that guy out. The problem is, is God's still here has to be careful too because he is by he's technically still the other's there but he's in a 1v1 Ooh. situation Ooh. Reaper takes a double tap oh dang now the 32 now the ice you did get a shot in on the 32 but it bound it's like he's just gonna uh, push up here are they gonna try and take this Roger Dodger out Looks like the Bone Shaker is going to try to get a shot. I mean, he pins his shots there, but uh, the Roger Dodger was actually holding up better than I expected the first few shots of this round. Uh, yes. Ash, you're going to try to put a big shot into somebody here and keep these guys back off of the Reaper. Lance is definitely going to try and get the side shots on that Reaper. Uh, looks like they're just going to push it here. Weenus goes down, it's just pin left. That's a lot of HP to have to shoot through in the ISU 152. Oh yeah, a lot of reload. Alright, well we're tied back up at 1-1. One, one. Nice. Uh, over on the 1TC side, uh, K's back in the Roger Dodger, 1346. Pin in that ISU with 726, and Dr. Weenus in the Reaper with uh, unfortunately not getting a shot in. All right. On the X-Gun side, we got Bone, or Houndstooth. 
the Bomb Shaker, 1377. Your Trash in the Skoda, 256. 1363 and Lance in the T32 1310. Pretty good damage awesome, spread on awesome. that side. Alright, let's see if they stick with tier 8 or if we're going to get a tier change now. Oh, we're going to tier 10. Ho ho ho. Tier 10. Can you never go wrong with tier 10. Three v three with tier tens. Definitely, Man. what tanks would you be bringing out? Um, trying to think, trying to think. Let's see. I mean, we ran like a cheap to the Marat and an E four, and then the Saint River. Is a good one. I mean, you know, I mean, let's be honest. E four is basically a heavy, right? Like, I mean. It's you basically run the two heavies, heavy except you're you're gonna get that that bigger alpha. So, I mean, I mean if you, you know, do the just, map, if you do the map, yeah. But I mean, you just gotta randomly pick, right? You just gotta like hope you pick good. I guess seven's never gonna be a bad draw. I mean, it's kind of like. Do you risk running a lot tank and then get by camels? Oh. You know, I mean, it's you just oh. you gotta pick and hope. I oh, know. I don't know. I don't know if they can do that. Yeah, I don't know if that counts as two auto loaders or not. Uh, yes, double barrel clip capable so that would be running two auto loaders not allowed oh it looks like they're changing i mean it looks like once you see i mean they're man with a pretty heavy lineup already so oh yeah yeah basically three heavies 258 hits like a freight train too What's up, Stubble Farmer? I mean, all three of these guys hit for what, at least? The ST2 is the lowest alpha damage there is. Well, I'm just talking on 1TC. I mean, that Panzer 7 still hits for what, like, 550, 600? 600. A lot of reload, but... Ooh, Qantas. We get Qantas. Gonna be a lot of driving. Oh yeah. All right, bear with us, guys. <laughs> no matter what, we see one more match after this. Oh yeah. I mean, we could still go the distance. We could. We always want tiebreaker. Gotta zoom way out to get them both in the screen. Yeah, I don't have, I don't even know if you can zoom out that far right now. I gotta go all the way up to do it. Holy crap. Have you always been able to go this high? Like, no, I don't think you've ever been able to go this high. Like, this is a new, 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 new. Alright, yeah, so it looks like, uh,. Us can just gonna cut kind of straight across the map towards the cap. Once you see coming through the town, it's like we are gonna meet up on the, the the DC line eventually here. Now, Ux can breaking apart like that could be a problem. If one TC realizes they have the overmatch. Yeah, I mean, if they if they realize they can push out Lance here. Now, the T-58 getting a little bit ahead of his teammates here. He's going to have to be careful. He's going to get lit up by Houndstooth or Lance here in a second. Yeah, Lance is in a position now, though, that, uh... Ooh, oh, wow, 7 takes a 700. 
See if that E4 can get up here in time to get another shot into him. Ooh, takes another 630 hit. Oh, the E4 bounce. T58 takes one from the ST, uh, ST2. T58 uh, hit all, what, three of his shots? All three of his shots there. All right, Panzer 7 getting a little aggressive here. Does bounce the shot. Able to move up to the position it looks like he wanted. I7 to get across that opening three of any punishment. Now it looks like the T57 or T58 really wants to poke this on the STI2. He does, pins his shot. E4 goes for the sh shot, bounces Ooh. though. E4 pin the T58. Oh yeah, he's a bad shot E4. and uh, bad spot. Took the shot from the I7 as well. Panzer 7 gonna rotate around and flank the ST2. ST2 is down to a one shot. Panzer 7 still not reloaded. 58 gonna try to rotate around here. Helm 2 gonna try to come in and help out the ST. Well, it looks like they may try to jump the Panzer 7 here. Oh, E4 takes a big shot from Yuri. Yuri Panzer bounces 7 holding up well, though. Oh, Helm 2 down to a one shot. Did it? Yeah, it got the buff, so the shoulders are no longer the weak point. Ooh. Yeah, there's a bounce off the lower plate. Oh, Yuri's oh, on Yuri's fire. On track. Pin got the pin. He is down. D58 picks up the kill. Elm Street still on 49. Lance a one shot for all of these guys. If I'm Weenus, I'm just going to go ram Elm Street and hope to get the kill. Pin goes down on the backside of the STI, too. We've got a 2v1 situation, and Weenus is just going to have to push this. Lance trying to push around in time to catch the 58, but he's not going to be able to. Got to, uh, got to get turned into a 1v1 situation. Looks like Weenus is going to push up in his face and give Caves time to flank around and get that backside shot. There's the kill shot. All right. One TC taking another round. Uh, you want to take damage first? Yeah, on the Oxygen side, we got your trash in the E4, 2546. Nice. And the ST2, 1230. Hound Street, the I7, 918. All right. And only Caves coming out with the uh, three kills. Picked up all three kills that game. 4027, uh, Witness, 1540, and Pin, 1333. A good game right there. So, that Panzer 7 block, 3180 that game he, he did good man that thing is definitely going to be oh we got a rando rando in the building here hopefully he uh gets removed before we launch there he goes bye bye Right. Wonder what tier we are gonna see this time. Looks like we're sticking with tier ten. Yep, staying with tier ten. What's up, uh, Education? How you doing? Hopefully you're having a good night. Yeah, I'm in here with him, bud. Three v three action. It's definitely a lot different. Yeah, it is. I mean, it's definitely fun. Definitely seeing a different lineup out of us can this time around. But once you see kind of. Don't, I mean, if it worked, it worked, right? Like, I wouldn't change a thing. Oh, I wouldn't either. I mean, 
Now this time, if it is an open map, Oxcan does have a little bit more vision, and they have that Tehran. Oh yes, that's going to be the the deciding factor if they get an open map. Oxcan should take it. Oh, we got a UE fifty-seven. Yeah. I mean, even if they launch with him, I don't think he could pin anybody. Oh, Hilbron. I don't. You know, I, I think this could work in uh, Scan's favor a little bit. Uh oh, we're in the one TC. They're they're coming back out with. Uh, Trusty lineup from the last match. Panzer 7, T58 Heavy, and the E4. Alright, on the Oxcan side, we got a Valor, a Marat, and a Tehran. Valor see what honestly happens. worked really well on this map, too. Valor works. I mean, the Marat's going to work. Tehran works. I mean... Well, TC's lineup, I mean, if they get up and hug by the cab, I mean, they could make this work as well and force us can to come into them, but. Let's have to see what happens. Alright, let's see, trying to get some early spots here. He should light up all three of them if he peeks this. Yeah, he's just got to be careful not to take a hit in return for, for spotting him. Does get the Panzer 7, not able to go up high enough to get the E4 and the 58. Right. Uh, he's going to get the heck out. Oh, 58, 58 does fire. light him. Oh, he does oh, get a shot he in. Get a shot in. A big hit too into that Marat. Oh, oh, he's got blind fired. Blind fired, but he goes into the tracks. So this is what I was saying to you. One TC just kind of pulled up. They've got the TV gate on cap. I mean, they're dug in here, and they're gonna have to force. They're gonna have to force us can to push into them. Panzer 7 is re rotating. Ooh, that was a blind fire. I don't think they can actually hit that base where, where that T 58 is sitting on the base. No, no, no. He's pretty safe. I mean, they can't see him. He's safely in behind rocks. I mean, they're going to have to push into it or get on cap. Uh oh, that point. Tron is going to meet that Panzer 7 here in a minute. Uh, oh, we got wide. No, I mean, I don't even know if the Panzer 7 can spot him. Now, the Marat should spot him here when he gets up closer, but. It's like the, the, the 7 going to try to put a little bit of extra cap pressure on. Ooh, force him into him. 49 seconds left on the cap. Now, Weenus is lit. Oh, Ooh, there's a big, big hit, hit from Yuri. All cap pressure is on the 50, 58. They can't get to him. Another hit goes into, into the Panzer 7. It's going to be on It's gonna be on the Valor to get the shot into the 58. It's going to be... Oh, Weenus takes another shot from Yuri. Yuri does get lit, but Weenus down to a one-shot. Going to have to hide here. Now, Lance should be able to see the 58 pretty clearly here. There he is. There's, There's three reset. Shot. Are they going to push him is the next question. I feel like they are just going to push into the Valor, but Yuri's going to get into a good position here. Marat's coming over top. It's not going to be as... Uh, 
easy as they're wanting it here. 58 is going to get focused out. Up to a two shot, but a it's one down. for Jury. Jury picks up the kill. E4 is going to push over. Now his question is, Tron and the Murats on reload. Are they going to get any help for uh, Lance here? If, if Lance would, would have backed down more, Houndstooth would have been able to start getting shots in. He's got to drag that E4 over more. There he goes. Come on, drag him out, drag him out. Houndstooth should have shots now. Ooh, bounce. First kill. Panzer 7's all that's left. Yep, Yuri's coming in, everybody's just gonna converge, and we're gonna get overtime. We did go to the distance. We are going to overtime. Wow. Jim Beaver, I gotta yeah, stop letting yeah. you call that. <laughs> <laughs> Every time me and you get streaming together and you call overtime, it happens. Hey, that's what we want, man. All right, over on 1TC, Caves in that 58 with 798. Pin in the E4, 781, and Weenus in the 7, uh, 566. All right, on the Arctican side, we got Lance and the Valor, 2962. Your Trash in the Tehran, 2436. Houndstooth in the Murat, 1352. Nice. All right. Tiebreaker. What right now, going to play? I'm assuming it's the same. It's just going to be random map. I don't know who picks tier, though. Everything stays the same. Swap sides and uh, uh, let's see who picked the last. So let's see. This will go back to the up can team to pick uh, tier. Sassy, dirty, baby, what is up? All right. Tier 10. Guys yeah, showed up just in time for overtime tonight. Oh, we're going back to eights. Going back to eights. What kind of tier eights are we gonna come out in overtime? I don't know. Do we see one TC going back to the Roger Dogger and one five two and or do they go something completely different? True. No, oh, Roger Dodger coming back up. T32 came back out. Bone Shaker came back out. All right, what was uh, what was us against third tank? Skoda. What was their third Skoda. tank going? Uh, was it the same lineup? Yeah, the same lineup. Let's go to with a double shot. Goliath, welcome in, bud. Okay, just went on two more tanks, and we will have the tiebreaker around the launch. This is just the best of five, so. All right. Wait, on one PC. 
So, Bama, so far, yes. just looking back, underscores. This is the mm -hmm. first match that hasn't been a 3 0. Really? Yes. Wow. I will have my first match up Saturday night. I don't know when we we haven't been scheduled yet. We're probably closer to the deadline. Yeah, with it being a holiday weekend, a lot of people are out of town. Oh yeah. I'm going to probably be home grinding uh, bigness out. We can get free. There you go. See, so you should get your get your season pass and be happy. All right. Well, while we're waiting on these guys to uh, pick teams. Oh, or chest. Let me know what they pick. Yep. All right, still no tank. Let's go tank. They have a TS5 selected. Uh -huh. Man, I'm not going to get one tank this time. <laughs> oh, there we go. There we go. LT1 LPC. I think I have that. Yeah, 7k gold. That's what we want to see right there. Oh, 2100. That's a nice pool. All right, they are selected. And I'm on my last war chest. Ah, 25 gold. Ah, I mean, I got a 25,000. That's pretty good. I can't complain. We are launching. Oh! Alright. Let's see what happens here. <laughs> the crude line. I'll be interested. I mean, uh... Who do you think's more picked for the city, bro? Um... I don't know about this TS5, honestly. It's the same thing as the Bone Shaker, just the unskinned version. Yeah. Okay. The T-34 so, I mean, they... is not my go-to pick, though. It hits really hard, but it's not got very much DPM. That is true. Yeah, I mean, you hit for like, what, 400, but that reload kills it. Now, I don't really, really know if it's going to bounce anything. If it gets hull down, it could. Hurt. Well, I have to that see. Runs, um, us can definitely down. having having the faster uh, faster path into the city. One CC going very very wide here. Yeah, I mean, and letting Yuri or getting letting that bone checker get set up on top of that hill. That's going to be deadly if they get spotted out in that open courtyard. I mean... I don't know. It's just, it's all going to come down to spotting again, though, and... or lack thereof. Exactly. Because there's not a ton of information out there, so... Whatever team finds that overmatch first. I see what happens. Roger about to peek it here. He does get lit by Yuri. Uh, I don't think the Bone Shaker or 32 have shots. Interesting. Bone Shaker looks like he's their head. It looks like he's trying to get shot, but there's just a little field in the way. Looks like 1TC is kind of locked down that little house area there. 
not really poking out too much. Alright, uh, does get spotted. He does. I'm actually shocked he's actually getting spotted from so far away, but I don't really play tier eights. I don't know spotting and everything for these guys. I wonder if the Roger Dodger she running optics. I mean, it's possible. I mean, Bone Shaker. I don't know. Could be the one lighting the Roger, and it's just getting lucky to light the thirty-two. Oh, okay, was the first one to take hit. damage. Uh, Dr. Wee yeah. is pushing up a little bit here. Can he get over right there? I think blocked that. I don't think so. I don't think he can anymore. I think he used to, but I think they changed it. I know they put up a lot of different invisible walls to stop certain climbs. Alright, Dodger on the long flank around here. He does find Yuri. Ooh, only gets a tracking shot in. Rotate around. See, actually, we're seeing everybody from us can rotate a little bit, but so Dodger is getting out of there. Or Caves, I'm sorry, I keep calling him the like, tank name. <laughs> All right, looks like we are seeing a rotation come out of the X Gun side. Now, I haven't seen um, Pin move. Like, he is just staying completely still for, like, several minutes now. I hope he didn't lag out. Our caves did get lit again. He did light your inner turn. Uh, Hounds Tooth starting to move in. It does just slip by the 34. His gun is not even moving. Yeah, I, I'm really worried Pin may lag out. Oh, there he goes. He's moving. Oh, trading shot between the Lance and Dr. Weenus. All right, Bone Shaker going to try to get a shot at 34. He does connect. They've got to punish the Bone Shaker here. They've got to hurt Helm's Tooth big time here. They can't let him get out of this. Oh, he gets another thing to Weenus. Oh, oh but the 34 bounced his shot. Now, Pin is coming in, but I think Helm's Tooth may survive here. I don't know. He's pulling back in to try to get a shot. Man, that, that Roger Dodger is holding up very well in this. Yeah, All right, Helm's going to try to flank around here. Ween is going to try to flank on the 32. If Penn stays where he is, he might be able to take the Bone Shaker out here. Oh, um, that's not good. 32 is down. 32, uh, 34 is down to a one-shot. 32 is just kind of got to push that. Roger, or only cave down to a one shot too. Weenus goes down. Oh, Hounds bounced the kill shot, but Hounds down to a one shot as well. 32 is going to flank around, get some good shots at the TF5. Caves is still trying to side scrape and trying to get Hounds out. Who wins that battle? Oh, the TF5 hey, goes Justin. down. Oh, another bounce by Caves. Go to bounces in the ass, but they do pick it up, and that is going to be an us can victory in the 3v3 tonight. 
I got to go, Beaver. We just got put underneath the tornado warning. Oh, shit. Yeah, go stay safe, buddy. All right, guys. Well, while Bama goes to get safe, we are going to end the stream there. Congratulations to uh, the Us Can team that out in the 3v3s. I believe the uh, 1TC team is going to move down into the uh, loser's bracket, and they will get to stay in the tournament at least for one more. This is a double elimination tournament. Take one last little look at the damage. Dr. Ween is coming out with 1446. Caves with 1413 and Pin, unfortunately, not getting any damage. Uh, over on the winner side, uh, Hounds in that Bone Shaker 2025, Lance 2 kill 1352, and Yuri in the Skoda 1 kill 1173. Alright, guys, thanks for watching, and I will catch y'all next time.